Hello. Welcome to Cure Disease Kuri Channel. Today is number two. Yesterday, Kuri smiled at me. I'm so happy. Today, I would like to talk about the RPLA, my daughter's disease. Today's question. What do you think of a brain disease? What symptoms uh, do you think it will have? DRPLA. Actually, it's a long name, long name. I cannot say. DRPLA is a disease in which brain become to shrink. It is a um, progressing disorder of ataxia, meaning your body is starting to decline. For example, having difficulty in walking, trouble in uh, eating and swallowing. At this time, there is no cure yet. There are only a few cases of DRPLA in various countries, but the majority of patients are in Japan. It is estimated to have thousands of cases worldwide, including Chris case. DRPLA has several features. This is a hereditary disease. Therefore, this disease is able to be passed on from parents to their children. The onset of the disease in the younger generation is much faster and more serious than the old generation. For Chris's case, she inherited the disorder from her father. Her father was diagnosed with DRPLA in his middle age and he got it from his mother. It means my mother-in-law. Symptoms of her grandmother began to appear after Kuri was born, after the age of 60. At first, she said, I stumble when I walk. She was a very kind mother-in-law to me, but she developed behavioral changes. She believed her husband to be a thief. After that, she became bedridden for a long time and died in her 80s. Kuri's father, Chiaki, I think his illness began when he was in his 30s. The progress was slow. At first, I thought that he just became short-tempered. But then, it became more intense. In his case, personality change was the most painful way. After that, he became unstable and he couldn't control his voice and behavior. I think Kuri had been ill since she was an infant. I thought that Kuri had a learning disability. When she was 8 years old, she had grandma scissors and gradually deteriorated she couldn't do the simple things that she used to do before. It was a hard time for Kuri. She started to use a wheelchair 10 years ago, and three years ago, she became bedridden. Let's go back to DRPLA. The clinical symptoms differ depends on the age of onset. For example, if you get sick at an early age, such as Kuri, you may have cerebral ataxia, such as myocronus, jackness, mental retardation, and instability. 
could have had many seizures. Symptoms of adult onset include cerebral ataxia, personality changes, and dementia. For my husband, Chiaki, he did not have a seizure. I think DRPLA is one of the most painful diseases. There may be multiple patients in one family. I wanted to encourage to my family, but it was so hard. My husband Chiaki always said, I want to give my life to Kuri. But on the other hand, he yelled at Kuri and threw her bags and shoes on the uh, floor. It was very, very hard time. But I believed tomorrow is a good day and never give up. Thank you very much for watching.